In 2014, Matthews launched a bow that was, well, kind of like a balloon. Kind of like the movie Up. So here we are, 2014. No, no, I'm just kidding. It's 2022. But in 2014, this bow was launched by Matthews. This, ladies and gentlemen, is the Helium. Super light bow at 3.5 pounds. And this bow feels less than 3.5, even though they claim 3.5. But as you can see, the honeycomb riser was in effect during this time. Uh, they had this uh, focus grip, which I love the focus grip. And I wish Matthews would bring it back, because to me, this was one of the coolest grips they ever did. It feels so nice. It's got uh, indentations. It feels really good. Now, obviously, they went to a split limb, dual cam design. This is still a solo cam bow, and it's very small. So let's talk about the specs real quick of the bow. This is, a again, a 2014 Helium. The brace height is 7 inches. Axle axle is 30 inches. Draw weights are 40 to 70 pounds. IBO is 332. Weight is 3.5. It's around 80% let off. So the bow, again, was a great shooting bow. It had really no pocket, as you can see. A lot of the bows during this time didn't have a, what they what you consider a normal pocket like you do today. Uh, harmonic dampers built in. This is a great shooting bow, guys. If you owned a Helium, I just recommend keeping it because this is a really, really cool bow. Anyhow, let's shoot through the chronograph, shoot it a little bit, and then we'll talk about it. All right, guys, uh, Helium, Matthews Helium, 2960. Yeah, 2960, 350 green arrow. 278. Oh, that's really nice. 2014. from Matthews 2014. It's so cool to go back in time and check out this bow. We actually did review this bow before in the past and I love this bow honestly and I'm so happy we're able to get our hands on this bow again and we're going to keep this one. I want to have it around for a lot longer. Again, great job by Matthews back in 2014 and I hope that they can relook at some of these things because honestly the, 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 the single limb design is so narrow. I just love it. I think it really changes the game Maybe everybody should have just one that's like this, that's really cool. And to be honest, if they sent this out today, I think people would buy it in a heartbeat because it is a really, really nice bow. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time on bowhunterplanet.com.